What's going on everybody? In the last video, uh, I talked about doing some stump grinding. So today, I am doing some stump grinding. Just left the rental place, uh, rented a stump grinder. It's like a Toro Dingo, it's got the tracks. I'll show it to you here in a minute when I get there. Uh, but yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking forward to, to doing this. I've never done it before. Uh, the guy told me kind of how to do it, kind of what you, what you want to do. I got a nice, uh, nice sexy uh, face shield so I don't get hit in the face. And uh, yeah, we're gonna knock them out. I got uh, eight to do, eight stumps. There's a couple of them that are pretty wide, uh, but uh, the majority of them aren't that, aren't that wide. So I rented this thing for four hours. Hopefully I can get it done in four hours. Uh, it cost me $95 to rent it for four, four hours. And I think it goes up to like 180 for a full day so if I can't get these knocked out in a timely manner then it's gonna cost me another hundred bucks which is fine because that's what I based my bid my original bid on to begin with was you know the full a full day so uh, so we're good either way but uh, I would really like to pocket that extra hundred dollars if I can
this is going pretty quickly. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six done. I got two more that I believe, but I'm gonna walk the property and see if there's any more. And uh, pretty sure there's not, but, uh, but yeah, it's going pretty good. Whoops, I actually had uh, the really big one I thought was gonna take a while, it was all rotted out, so it just kinda came out in chunks. So, uh, so yeah, you know, it's not too hard. It's a little, little tricky to get it to where you know, it actually looks kind of even and not all rounded, but if it's below the surface of the ground, that's all I care about. One more property to go mow today. Actually, the only property that I have to mow today, but it's a, it's a little bit over an acre. Uh, this is a property that I've mowed uh, a couple times before, but it was a couple years ago. They kind of just call me whenever needed. Uh, you know, not a huge deal, but I'm gonna make a little bit of money today. So I did the stumps. Uh, you know, it took about two hours, add in some drive time, returning the equipment. Uh, all that so you know I only got like four or five hours during the day to really really get as much done as I can basically what I'm doing is the guys have their schedule it's pretty much a full week schedule they're getting everything done every week uh, and, but it's taken right about a week so anything new that's coming up is I'm taking this little trailer that I borrowed from my dad and I'm loading up one of the mowers and I'm going out and hitting some of the new stuff you know cleanups you know we got the mower you know this house here that we're gonna go mow uh, you know just just all the new stuff that's coming up and not like I said I know I keep saying this in the videos but I'm getting calls uh, and the only thing that's changed is my truck and website so I've had customers say both found you on the website seen your truck so uh, the advertising is working right now uh, so I'm very very happy but uh, anyway like I said, there's just not a whole lot of time for me during the day to get out. a whole lot done, but I get enough done to where I can I can keep up with all the new stuff coming in so far. But I'm pretty close to being to where I might need to hire a fourth person. And uh, you know, I did have Josh, the part-time guy, which I still have him, but uh, he got hurt, so he's gonna be out for a little while. But I'm thinking about maybe hiring another full-time person and maybe some days they can come work with me. I can drop them back off with the guys. The guys can have four, four guys on a crew. I don't necessarily like four guys on a crew, but some of the big stuff we do, it would really help out. Some of the smaller stuff, I think four guys is too much. But, you know, if I plan it out right, I think, uh, I think it can work. But not quite there yet, but if we pick up too many more, that's gonna have to happen. So, so yeah, I'm I'm just stoked, man. And business just keeps going up a little bit at a time, a little bit at a time, and uh, I'm good with that.